you're going to need some eggs, butter, salted or unsalted, chia butter, and your pork of choice. Okay, let's get started with the hardest part. Let's make the hollandaise sauce. Start by separating the egg whites. This has to be one of my top favorite breakfasts, but it is kind of heavy, so it is definitely not an everyday thing. Now give your egg yolks a good whisk. Add two tablespoons of butter, salted or unsalted. Just reduce the salt at the end if you're using salted. I'm using Westgold. It's a New Zealand butter and it comes from grass-fed cows. Why am I using it? Because it's amazing. Of course, you can use any butter you like. I'm sure it'll taste great. Place your eggs over your boiling water. Try not to touch the pan because we don't want to scramble the eggs. We just want to cook them. Start incorporating your butter little bit at a time and then more as you go. Watch out, the pan can get a little bit hot, so be careful. Look at that gorgeous yellow color. Stunning. That looks just about right. Salt to taste and a hint of vinegar or lemon juice. I'm using smoked pork butt. It's not really butt, it's from the shoulders and neck of the pig. I like it because it's reasonably priced and it comes in thick chunks. Fry it up and get it all nice and golden brown. I'm just using some store-bought olive ciabatta from here in Korea where I live. Of course, if you want to go the traditional route and use an English muffin, that's also great. I'm just not that fond of them. <laughs> oh. 
I think this should be enough for one person. Okay, let's get started with the eggs. Add a little vinegar to your water. Give the water a little stir before gently placing the eggs in. I place my eggs in another bowl before putting them in the water. I think this works out better. Let them cook for about 3 minutes if you want a runny center. Okay, let's plate up our food. Add your pork first and then add your poached eggs on top. Wrap your sunshine in a bowl, aka hollandaise sauce, and dribble it all over the top of those wonderful eggs. Add a little black pepper or cayenne pepper if you like. Dig in. Enjoy your eggs benedict. As an alternative to pork, you could also try using steamed spinach, which is called eggs florentine. Also delicious. Worth a try.